And on Saturday night, sure to be a special evening for Birmingham's Matthew Macklin, former European champion, aiming to win back his old belt on home soil. Here's Ed Robinson. Matthew Macklin's hoping for a triumphant homecoming on his return to Birmingham. As he bids to regain the European title, he never lost in the ring. There's no way I'm going to lose uh, the European title here in Birmingham, my hometown. I'm going to... Uh... I'm going to put on a, but not, not just win the fight, but I want, I want it to be an explosive performance and a performance that you know everyone goes away talking about it and they want to see the next Matt Macklin fight. The Midlands middleweight is fresh from an intense training camp with master coach Freddie Roach in the famous Los Angeles wildcard gym. It's a challenge for world titles and to step up to the next level. I felt that I needed that extra, that extra quality sparring. I'm one of those fighters that if I spar fighters below me, I drop to their level. If I'm sparring people on my level or you know world champions, whatever, I, I raise my game. Last year, Macklin looked sensational when he first won the prestigious EBU belt, simply blowing away Finland's Amin Asikainen in one round. It is waved off! What a sensational win for Matthew Macklin, European champion, and catapults himself into world class. I thought it was going to be late rounds, points, you know, a tough fight, but uh, no, well, I landed a sweet left hook in the first round, and the rest is history. Uh, be nice to have an early night again. It seems that at 28, Macklin's finally peaking. He's unbeaten in all nine fights since moving up in weight, following a sensational brawl with Jamie Moore four years ago. Now he faces Shalva Jomodashvili, a tough and durable Georgian visitor. Never been stopped, and uh, you know I'm sure it'll be a, you know he'll, he'll give me a tough fight. But he hasn't boxed on my level. I don't think he's fought anyone with the, the boxing ability of me. So I'm looking forward to a very good performance. And the fighter known as Mac the Knife is feeling razor sharp and ready to press his claims for a world title shot. I think that's coming close now. I think I'm going to get my shot soon, and uh, you know I'm, I'm, I'm more than ready to step up and, and win the world title now. Matthew Macklin's got the looks, got the talent. Should he be further ahead in his career right now? Yeah, but I think he's actually realised that now. Taking himself over to America, changing the whole setup of his preparation for fights. I did it. It makes all the difference. Gives you that confidence when you get in the ring. Not, not a confidence you can buy, borrow or pretend to have. He's gone and, gone and done that spa with everybody, fresh opponents. And so therefore it improves your fight game. You have to admire him going to America, training with Freddie Roach, training with the best there is out there. It shows he's, he's knuckling down now. He's taken himself out of his home comforts, uh, so that is now gone. He has to want to fight, he has to want to be there. So if he's had a bad day in the gym, he's got to go back to that same gym the next day because that's the only reason he's out there. So doing this improves everything about his career. It just shows how much he wants it. And doing it in front of your home fans, extra special. His mum lives two miles away. Great, a great opportunity to show off, to say, look, look this is how well I've done. This is how it works.